Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks. If somebody is trying to draw something really mechanically and they need a 10 inch long line that was part of a circle that was a circumference of 50 inches. So I'm gonna use pi, I'm, I'm not a big math person, but I can figure this out. So I'm gonna draw it in lips. I'm gonna take my pi number and put it up here so I can see it. I'm gonna bring out a calculator. We need a 50 inch circle divided by 3.14159265.35. And we get that number. Let's just copy that number, right click, copy, click on, click on your circle and just put that number, so delete that number and just paste that number into your deal and hit enter. Let's check our math here. Grab that circle, convert it to a curve, go up to Windows, Dockers, Properties, and click on this curve icon, and we're at 50.00702, and that's because we could extend the pi out further and further. But we only need 10%. We only need 10 inches of that 50 inch line. Two ways to do it. I'm gonna make a duplicate of this uh, number so we can, let me hit Control D and make a duplicate and then move it over. So there's two ways you can do it. One way I would do is draw a straight line, hit P. And because both of them are in the center of the page, Control D on your duplicate of your line and rotate it 70 degrees, which is one fifth. Take your virtual segment, delete key, and delete these lines. And you have this part right here, which is already a curve. So we'll go to Windows, Dockers, Properties. And if you look, it is 10.00141. I mean, almost perfectly 10 inches. Well, I, I deleted both my circles. Well, let's just, we can do that again. We still got our uh, number in our paste. Just delete that number, hit paste, hit enter. Why not use the arc mode and just type in 72 degrees? We got the exact same line, same length. Uh, on a different plane as the other one, but that's my old one. But they're identical. They're you know we haven't turned that one into a curve, so this is good. And then hit your curve right here, and we're at ten point zero zero three seven. It's a little bit different. Ten point zero zero one versus 10.00037, so it's, it's minute. But that's how you would make a 10 inch line arc that's part of a 50 degree radius of a circle. I know that's not gonna help too many people, but thank you for watching.